This video is part of a series. Be sure to check out the description of this video for the, a link to the full playlist. And today we're building on, again, we've been working with functions uh, in our shell. So let's go ahead and go to the function script that we've already created. And uh, here we've passed some variables to it, but let's talk about global and local variables. If you've done any type of programming before and you've used functions, you are probably very familiar what global variables are and what local variables are. Uh, and if not, we're going to go over it today in shell scripts. So basically a global variable is a variable that you set and anywhere in your program you call that variable, it is going to use it unless that function has a local variable and a local variable is, is set to a certain function. It does not leave that function. So what we're going to do here is we're going to create a variable and we'll call it x and we'll just say x equals 20. Okay, so anywhere we use dollar sign 20, or sorry, dollar sign x, we should get the number uh, of 20. So let's go ahead, I'm going to delete this line, this line, and I'm going to change this line to be an echo command. So we're not calling our function at all at this point, but I'm going to say global x is dollar sign x. So when we run this, which is script this or even aid executable using change mod. We did that in a previous video. Forward slash, meaning current folder, run this script. You can see X is 20. Now, let's go ahead and go into our function here. And here I'm going to say global X is still dollar sign X. And here I'm going to call my function. So what we're hap what's happening here is we're saying, okay, x equals 20, echo this line out with the value of x, then call this function, which is going to display this. So let's go ahead, save that and run it. And it works just as we would think. So even inside our function currently, x equals 20. And I can change that. I can come up here and change it to 10. Run the script and you can see now both say 10. Now let's say we want to have x inside our function that is a different x than the global x. Well we can do that by saying x equals 20 at this point let's say but we're gonna say before that local meaning now we are changing x or saying the value of x but only inside this function. So now I can say echo local x is dollar sign x. So if I run this, now we get our global x is 10, global x is still 10, but local x, so anywhere in this function from this point on, x is now 20. But that doesn't change our global variable. So if we go back into our, our script here, I can now say echo global x is still dollar sign x. I run this now and we can see global x is 20, global x inside our function is still 20, then we changed x inside our function to be, I'm sorry I said 10, I said 20, it's 10, uh, local x, so anywhere inside that function from that point on x equals 20, but then we move outside of that function back out into our main portion of our script and x is still 10 outside of that function. So that is global and local um, variables in Bash in your Linux shell. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you found it useful. If you did find it useful, think about becoming a supporter over at patreon.com forward slash metalx1000. Even a dollar a month is very useful, very appreciated. If you can't f support financially, think about becoming a supporter by uh, commenting below, liking and sharing this video and also subscribing to my channel. I thank you for watching and I hope that you have a great day.